Discover, connect, make a difference. Hi Falcons, today we're going to show you some information about something new. It's our assignment tracker, so I'm going to jump right into it. You're going to be wondering, why are we doing this? What, what is this assignment tracker? So I'm going to give you just a brief tutorial and then your teachers are going to fill in the rest for you. So let's jump into why assignments are even important because that's why we're going to be measuring this. So first and foremost, you're by completing your assignments, you're able to get feedback from your teachers in the moment. Your teachers use any assignment that you are completing to adjust their instruction to meet your learning needs. That means if you don't turn in your assignment, guys, your teachers have no idea of where you need help prior to any kind of test. I'll also share with you that the second why is your own academic success. When you are turning in assignments regularly and receiving feedback from your teachers, it allows you to do much better when it comes time to do that test or that big project. You're gonna be confident and know exactly what you need to do. And once again, last but not least, support, support, support. We want to be able to support you in your learning, but the only way that we can do that is when you are turning in assignments on a regular basis so that we can give you feedback on what you need to know or improve upon. All right, this is what the assignment tracker looks like. So you can take a look at this little bit, little snapshot here. You're gonna see that there is a link to Infinite Campus right there that will help you. You're also gonna notice that on the left side of that spreadsheet that there is an area for you to input your missing assignments, if you have any, for every single class, as well as your grade in every single class. So how do we do this? Okay, you're gonna be going to your counselor's Canvas page. Once again, you're gonna click on that Falcon Creed module, the same module that you went to um, when you completed your learner reflection last week. You are then going to go to the assignment that is labeled assignment tracker. That will prompt you to open the assignment tracker or the spreadsheet into a full view on your screen. Click for that full view and you will be able to see the assignment tracker. The next thing that you're gonna be doing is you'll go into Infinite Campus. You can also use Canvas if you'd like, but primarily you'll go into Infinite Campus and you're gonna be checking for any missing assignments that you may have in a two-week period. For our first round, we're going to be starting today, September 15th, and we're going to run through September 21st and 22nd. That's going to be your first time frame that you'll be looking at an Infinite Campus to determine if you have any missing assignments. Our hope is that you'll have zero missing assignments, and you'll see why in just a minute. Once you get onto that assignment tracker, and you're looking at Infinite Campus, you're gonna record any missing assignments you might have for the particular class that you are in. You're also gonna record your current grade in that class. At the end of the quarter, we will provide you with an opportunity to reflect on your progress throughout the quarter and turning in those assignments and how that is impacting your grade and the feedback you are receiving in each of your classes. So what will you need to do? Again, you're gonna to go to that assignment tracker, which will be on your counselor's Canvas page. Again, it is under the Falcon Creed module. You're gonna see a set of instructions that will be provided for you uh, regarding the assignment tracker on your counselor's Canvas page. It says right there, every other week, you're gonna check your grades on Wednesday and Thursday in every single class. Once you've checked all your grades, you'll follow the directions on the spreadsheet, which is the assignment tracker, to record the number of any missing assignments you may have and your overall grade. So here's the fun part. It is so important that you are completing your assignments. And because it's so important to your own learning, we're gonna incentivize this. You are gonna receive one raffle ticket from each of your teachers every time you have zero missing assignments within that time period for their class. 
All right, so let's get into this a little bit more. Importance equals incentives here at Rockwood South. And so because we want you to be completing those assignments and it is so vital to your learning, guys, we've added this additional incentive. After you complete your assignment tracker in each particular class every two weeks, your teacher will be giving you a Falcon ticket for having zero missing assignments during that time period, okay? If you have zero missing assignments for all of your classes, this would mean that you have seven tickets. You're gonna place your tickets in your Friday lunch bin. We will have those bins set up for you by next week so that you can see those bins. Please take note that many of you guys have different lunch shifts. If it is an A day or a B day, you want to make sure that the bin that you put it in will be uh, the lunch shift that you are in on next Friday, September 23rd, okay? These drawings will always be every other week on Fridays. Our plan, we're going to draw three names at every single lunch shift. So at every lunch shift, we will draw three names and we will give out prizes. And so I know uh, some, some candy is on the list for that, but there are many other prizes that we're gonna be looking to give out throughout the school year. So excited to do that. All right, here's a glimpse of what those Falcon tickets will look like. And once again, our goal is for every single one of you guys to be earning these every two weeks for our drawings. Um, you can see the front side there to your left and on the right side, it will prompt you to write your name, your first and last name on it. That's really important because if we draw the ticket and you don't have your name on it, we'll have no idea who won. So make sure that once you get those tickets, you write your name on it, and then you're gonna be placing them in your Friday lunch bin. All right, some dates of importance for you just to review them. Special start date is today, September 15th. So your first assignment check-in day for every single class period will be either on the 21st or on the 22nd. And that is dependent upon if you have an A-Day, B-Day class, okay? So you may have some checks in your A-Day classes and then some checks the next day on the 22nd in your B-Day class. Sixth grade, super important for you because you will be at camp, some of you, on the 21st and 22nd. Your first check-in days will be on September 26th and September 27th. So it's a little bit longer for you. Our first ticket drawings, okay? First ticket drawings. Remember to put those tickets in your Friday lunch bin and we will start drawing tickets for seventh and eighth grade students on Friday, September 23rd. Sixth grade, again, yours is gonna be a little bit different because you're at camp, some of you, on the 23rd. So your very first drawing will be on September 28th. So make sure that you have those tickets in and that you are ready and prepared so that uh, you can win. The more tickets you have in the bin, the more chance you have to win. So just remember that every two weeks, we take all of the names out, all the tickets are removed, and we start over. So it gives everybody an equal opportunity every two weeks to turn in those assignments and to earn those tickets. And really the most important thing, guys, is that you should be getting some really good feedback from your teachers to support your academic success. All right, at this moment in time, you're welcome to ask your teachers any questions that you may have. Hey guys, I believe in you and I know that you're gonna do an awesome job of turning in your assignments. Most of you guys are already doing this, so we're just gonna be celebrating you for doing what you're already doing. Keep up the great work, Falcons.